book two the book of the traveler of the worlds canto 11 the kingdoms and godheads of the greater mind page 263 a memory steals in from lost heavens of truth a wide release comes near a glory calls a mind looks out an estranged felicity in glamorous passages of half wheeled light wandering a brilliant shadow of itself this quick uncertain leader of blind gods this tender of small lambs this minister serf hired by a mind and body for earth use forgets its work mid crude realities it recovers its renounced imperial right it wears once more a purple robe of thought and knows itself the ideals seer and king communicant and prophet of the unborn hired to delight and immortality all things are real that here are only dreams in our unknown depths sleeps the reserve of truth on our unreached heights they reign and come to us in thought and muse trailing their robes of light but our dwarf will and cold pragmatic sense admit not the celestial visitants awaiting us on the ideal speaks or guarded in our secret self unseen yet flashed sometimes across the awakened soul hide from our lives their greatness beauty power our present feels sometimes the regal touch our future strives towards the luminous thrones out of spiritual secrecy they gaze immortal footfalls in mind's corridors sound our souls can climb into the shining plains the breaths from which they came can be our home his privilege regained of shadowless sight the thinker entered the immortal's air and drank again his pure and mighty source immutable in rhythmic calm and joy he saw sovereignly free in limitless light the unfallen plains the thought created worlds where knowledge is the leader of the act and matter is of thinking substance made feeling a heaven bird poised on dreaming wings answers truth's call as to appearance voice form luminous leaps from the all shaping beam and will is a conscious chariot of the gods 
and life, a splendor stream of musing force carries the voices of the mystic sons. A happiness it brings of whispered truth, there runs in its flow, honeying the bosom of space, a laughter from the immortal heart of bliss, and the unfathomed joy of timelessness, the sound of wisdom's murmur in the unknown, and the breath of an unseen infinity. In gleaming clarities of Amistus air, the chainless and omnipotent spirit of mind brooded on the blue lotus of the idiom. A gold supernal sun of timeless truth poured down the mystery of the eternal ray through a silence quivering with the word of light on an endless ocean of discovery. Far off he saw the joining hemispheres on meditation's mounting edge of trance, great stairs of thought climbed up to unborn heights where time's last ridges touch eternity's skies and nature speaks to the spirit's absolute.